extend to the ministry a testimony of Catherine Kuman from Birmingham a couple of days ago. He spoke something that caught my interest. But I'm going to tell you something that anointing for dominion is scary and dangerous. Catherine Kuman experienced it only for the, for, the, for the last three years of her life. And I saw it on her. Dear God, did I see it on her. I was there. I was there. Nobody had to tell me. I saw it. With my own eyes, I saw it. Now, Catherine Kuman has been a minister for many, many years. Many, many years. But she stepped into the glory of the Spirit of God three years before she passed three years was what took what was the only three years that I Pastor John would say she did ministry the rest was nonsense do you know that there are men of God preachers that have been doing ministry for 20 years that were never captured in Zion I heard a story from Billy Graham before he passed on somebody asked him and said if you were given the privilege to preach again to come back to your youth what would you do he said I would preach less he said I would preach maybe 10 percent and use 90 to 80 percent of my life in prayer and studying of scriptures when a father could speak that way so how many preachers do we have in the streets talking yes they are talking revelation but there's no glory you know why you can go and start talking revelation but time to prove what you're saying you can't prove it jesus never spoke revelation his revelation was captured in bringing a dead man for four days out from the grave that alone is an un indisputable revelation show me a man that could ask for five loaves of bread and two fishes he multiplied it and fed five thousand men you are, we, are, we are talking nonsense preaching with no power didn't jesus says go not to preach for me wait until you receive dynamo he didn't ask them to go and witness it you will not be my witness until you receive power now, how many are witnessing Christ that have no power? You think power is uh, mama, 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 mama. headache got healed? Believe you shall be healed? Jesus never told anybody to believe to be healed. He healed everyone. When the woman with the issue of blood touched the hem of his garment, the blood dried up. That's power. Father, if you have given me only 10 people in this ministry, I'll be the most successful pastor in the world. I will not be deceived by crowd. I will not be deceived by the applauses of men. I will not be deceived by the acceptance of men. Oh, Father. Father. Father, help me to be focused. I don't seek the approval of man. Help me, Lord, to stay humble. Help me to stay broken. Help me, Lord. May my life be a blessing to many. If I have 10 years more to live, if I have five more, if I have one day, if I have two more years, if I have two more days, let it be that God used these days for his glory.